In this video we are going to talk how 5G will revolutionize future economy. So before starting this video, please like this video and subscribe to our channel for future updates. Over the past decade, humanity's way of life has been completely upended by one technology, the internet. We interact with physical objects and processes in ways that are beyond our ability to see and comprehend. Computer processors and sensors are increasingly controlling our autos, homes, factories, and public transportation. This connectivity already exceeds many of last century's science fantasy imaginings, but is likely to increase even more significantly with the advent of 5G. The broader reality is that 5G network infrastructure will connect billions of sensors, gadgets, automobiles, machines, and other things besides smartphones. What must be realized is that 5G will connect an increasingly data-hungry public with more devices demanding a greater amount of data. People, not just their favorite apps, will be connected to things, and things will be connected to one another for purposes far more important than enjoyment. Over time, there will be greater integration between networks and we will begin to experience the Internet of Everything. There is an array of well-known applications for 5G, including virtual reality and even driverless cars in the future. However, there are some potential transformational aspects of the technology. As 5G develops, it will provide wider capacity and lower latency that will allow for more connections and applications that we may not even dream of today. Ten years ago, could we have imagined how 4G-enabled phones would take over our lives today? This can include industries that are essential for our economy, such as agriculture, medicine, and education. These industries will be able to leverage the speeds of 5G to create instant communication and connection. Not to mention crucial government tasks such as military operations and local public safety. To summarize, 5G is expected to affect every industry, business, non-governmental organization, and government in the world. Near real-time connectivity and network slicing technology in 5G will spur disruptive innovation in every sector throughout the globe. There are civic uses of 5G that could enable smart cities, while companies are also researching into the potential revolutionary applications of 5G. In recent years, the European Patent Office has seen a 54% increase in patent applications relating to smart devices. This took place over 2013 to 2016, which was prior to the deployment of 5G. What 5G can do all of the above IoTs will be supplemented with real-time machine learning and artificial intelligence thanks to 5G connectivity AI. It will enable the low latency and split-second response required for remote robotic surgery as well as more safely regulating transportation, such as aerial drones, high-speed trains, and self-driving public and private cars in city traffic. As a result, this new IT infrastructure will be far more important to humankind than the Internet has ever been. Furthermore, millions of transactions in global financial markets and trade will be carried out through the next generation of Internet access. In the future, it is likely that 5G opened the capacity for businesses to deploy real-time supply chain tracking, as well as fleet asset tracking and management processes. It is also possible for wireless manufacturing processes that could reduce inefficient wires that are laid throughout factories. This will enhance the possibility for more advanced robotics as well as speed up automation capacities. As a result, many businesses will experience massive efficiency and productivity gains that can raise profits. The need of reskilling global workforces in front of the next wave of labor disruption cannot be overstated. Multiple data streams will be able to run in parallel over shared network infrastructure thanks to a new technical capability known as network slicing. Businesses will have the opportunity to access sections of the network and even sell off these sections. This can be done based on the needs of the business at a given time. As such, the business will be able to take on more services and network activities simultaneously. There has been an effort by Huawei, Ericsson, and ZTE to cooperate with mobile operators to deploy this technology. The 5G new radio design will enable network topologies to be altered on the fly in order to manage a huge number of devices, up to 1 million per square kilometer. Timetable for the deployment of 5G infrastructure and service offerings. One of the big challenges to 5G are the enormous capital investments to get it off the ground. There are also many regulatory requirements that must be met as 5G works with governments according to some estimates. Global spending on 5G infrastructure would exceed $14 billion by 2021. 
These 5G companies will have to navigate domestic and international laws while protecting user privacy and government security, especially in the era of cyber attacks. This will require them to develop proper legal platforms to operate on and gain the trust of the public and governments. Now that 5G is becoming available around the world, businesses and governments are discussing how to leverage the technology to benefit their communities. As of now, the United States is still not caught up to peers in its 5G rollout, such as South Korea or even China. Nonetheless, there is still fierce competition taking place over the technology. South Korea quickly ramped up its 5G for the 2018 Winter Olympics, but now is gradually rolling out 5G coverage for the rest of the country. They aim to reach 90% of South Korea's population by 2026. Mobile technology and services are predicted to expand from $3.3 trillion in 2016 to $4.2 trillion next year as a percentage of global GDP. Although lamp posts, bus stop shelters, and other existing buildings may be utilized in some cases, 5G networks are significantly more dense than previous generations, requiring 5x as many towers as cell phone networks. Europe is the most heavily penetrated mobile market in the world. In France and Belgium, Orange has been testing 5G technology. AT&T and Verizon's 2018 5G service announcements included only consumer residential options in a few cities, which isn't even true 5G, but the real stuff is on the way. It's tough to justify a large network expansion before smartphone manufacturers and customers have switched to 5G phones. It is important to consider whether now is the right time to invest in 5G devices prior to the full deployment of 5G infrastructure. Chips for 5G smartphones are being developed by Qualcomm, Samsung, and others, but worldwide technical standards have not been revised yet. All of this supercharged internet activity is going to increase the physical world's privacy and security issues significantly. I've worked with over 20 of the top 100 telecommunications firms, as well as critical infrastructure protection agencies in a dozen countries, to identify security and privacy risks and devise new ways to address them. In 2018, the U.S. Department of Homeland Security organized a task to determine what type of security protocols should be implemented to guarantee the stability of 5G, as well as the security risks of the technology. This assessment will go much beyond the current, hot button, focus on a few Chinese equipment manufacturers. When discussing the necessity to secure global supply chains, Christopher Krebs, director of the Department of Homeland Security's Cybersecurity and Infrastructure Agency, CISA, the importance of building a foundation for trust in safe providers. US and European cybersecurity officials met to discuss their concerns over China's Huawei technologies. On the European side, they acknowledged some of the potential security issues regarding Huawei, but they did not believe these concerns were impossible to overcome. The American side noted that it only takes one line of computer code among millions in 5G network to compromise the system. Any hostile country or terrorist organization could disable or manipulate vital 5G infrastructure. Americans, according to skeptics, are more concerned about trade issues from China than about security risks. They prefer to collaborate with a number of different equipment suppliers. The British are evaluating their 5G security plan right now. There are some Bitcoin miners who have infiltrated some IT systems and corporations. The aim is to rob them of certain computational capacity. This is because cryptocurrency blockchains require computer processing in large quantities for processing transactions. This vulnerability is already being exploited as a window into the enormity of cyber threats affecting the business world. Thanks to 5G, such attacks, as well as a slew of others, might move much faster before being noticed. All governments can take a tiny step by requiring security checks and raising technical requirements as a condition of issuing 5G spectrum licenses, but such restrictions will be meaningless against renegade nation-states. Standards and competition Meanwhile, the world's most powerful nations and major global IT firms are fighting for a competitive advantage in the transition to 5G. There are engineers across the industry who are testing thousands of potential technical solutions to various technology questions related to 5G. According to the global standard setting process for 5G, they analyze each technological proposal using a merit-based consensus building technique. What are your thoughts on our video? What do you think about the pros and cons of 5G? Please let us know in the comment section below.
If you enjoyed this video and would like to hear from me again, please subscribe and turn on the notification before leaving. Thank you for watching us.